Yes. What is up, everybody? This is this is good night, and uh, welcome back to this channel. Right. Sorry, I didn't know. I'm seeing your comments, guys. We just ah, we are waiting. We just say ah, sorry, guys. <laughs> sorry for keeping you waiting. We are now live, and uh, today I have uh, my brother Tawanda. So we want to talk about forex trading. Forex trading. If you have got any questions about the forex trading, this is the time uh, for you to ask. Because there was a dear and guy that I said in the video, digital anguranya ema ways of making money online. So as I was explaining, uh, forex trading. So people started asking, but hey, forex trading, so today I have got my brother, uh, forex trading. So if there are any questions, feel free to ask. I'm seeing Arnold, Arabuti, hi, Kundi, how are you? Thank you so much. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, no, no problem, second. It's my pleasure <laughs> being here. I, uh, nice one. Guys, if you're watching this video, please share with your friends. That is, just share it in my groups, share it everywhere. Even if you watch this video, Tattoo Live, that is, just share it. So, uh, one of the questions that I want to ask uh, <laughs> and is, is it safe? Because, okay. Right, I want to ask something, uh, Tawanda. Chimbotu yes. is all about forex trading. Chish knows the forex trading. Chish knows the answer to about forex trading. All right. Uh, well, forex trading uh, is a, it's a market. Um, I can explain it just like any other market. So, Chimbotu, for example, um, you know, think some vegetables, and it, that's a market. You go Kumbari, there is a market where people buy and sell vegetables. So then we've got what are called financial markets. Um, the most popular being the stock market, where people buy and sell shares of listed companies. You know, like Panana, Econet, Delta, and the likes, Old Mutual, all of those shares. You can, you can buy and sell those shares. And it, uh, so that's a stock market where shares are traded. The Forex market now, what then happens is the commodity are currencies. So you buy and you sell currencies speculatively uh, so that you can make a profit. Uh, so me say, for example, uh, if I think the euro is going to go up in value, I can buy it, NAS. Uh, if it, when it goes up in value, then I sell it and keep the profit. So uh, like any other market, you, uh, you buy something if the price goes up, then she or ten guess and 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 you make your profit. This is a maybe the simplest way I can explain it. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So so uh, it's like Sakatoti races or says we don't have boys and I'm coming on in Marim Ruth Vere. I know I'm not taking a marriage, I'm taking my years in my ego kisha. Yeah, you know, you know, I'm a road digger. It's only market, it's only for you. Uh, the buy and sell, uh, my current is more. But although, as well, in what I'm focused on is not really what happens on the street, it's to change out trader, uh, closer to the international interbank market. Uh, so you, you know, like when you move street, but I need rate, it's an important rate mark saying in the, that's the rate for the whole day. But it's also now when you trade online, uh, we are getting a feed of my exchange rates in real time as they are changing. And it, so I, I can be in a position easily and uh, maybe after 15 minutes in the position match because I'm connected to the real real time uh, feed in my, in, my, in my currencies. All right. So, uh, uh... All right, sorry, I think connection maybe even the cottage teaser. Um, can you please repeat and answer our phone? Why?
exactly just like anything um you can also do forex trading for a, for a living but the most important thing is you need to know what you eh mabundi zaka ya yeah, ndrukunzwa mrundi nzwa clear and it hello mr kundai eh All right. Okay. Um it's it's very possible for you to do that um as a career even as a job. Um just like anything else. Yes, you I can knowledge. hear you. Yes, I can hear you. Yes. Um I'm just saying just like anything else you need to have the knowledge of what you're doing. So I think the most important thing for anyone who wants to get into oh. forex trading so, is to acquire uh, the knowledge first of all. Um, you know, I cannot be a farmer without the knowledge of farming. I cannot be a doctor without the knowledge of um, practicing medicine. And it, so, forex is not exempt. The first thing is you need to know. You need to equip yourself with knowledge. Can only only that knowledge now. Then you can then go and trade. So. Yes, the answer is yes. You you can uh, do forex trading for a living. Oh, so kuni re kuni endo kuno zidziroa. Kwa ene endo zidziroa kuni re kana ma college kana ma university. Um, oh, um, our traditional institutions, uh, they don't really offer that. Um, I'm surprised. Like go kuna na our universities, one of my degrees in finance and so on. Um. But the problem in you know, Anzuiti is that you know most of the things that you are, that you learn at our my universities or our colleges, it's very hard for you to actually monetize those things and start making money. So many people. I was in the supermarket the other day. Uh, I got saved by someone. Anga chinditcha ane degree re business management from from MSU. This person anga patio. I chair patio. So the, the problem is that uh, this this um, this knowledge that they are acquiring from my investors is very difficult for them to monetize it. But Yeku Forex, um, like me myself, I, I I've been trading since 2013, um, and I I've been also running a, a school, a trading school, in Arare. Um, so we we offer lessons for starting from beginners. Uh, we've got something that we call the forex starter course for for beginners. So no one plus one. The first one we got, you can change on the forex. To talk about what is forex, to talk about the very basics. So yes, um, there there could be also be other people offering that, um, in in Zimbabwe, um. But I think I, I can only speak for for myself. I can only speak for myself. So um, my school is called Forex Trading School Zimbabwe, and uh, we are at Batanai Gardens, uh, first floor. That, that's that's where we, we hold our um, our trainings. So tonight our monthly courses. Um, um, you, 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 the course is four weeks long, so we do two lessons per week. On Wednesdays and Fridays, so that's from 5:30 p.m. to around 7:00 7:30 p.m. So that's after hours. So when I'm watching down my bus, I work in all my investors, my college, and so on. People are if you are busy during the day, it's it's, it's not a problem. But we we start our lessons uh, after hours. Yes, it's a very okay. long way of answering your question, but I, I guess I've answered it. I know, uh, do tell just what we really want to learn. Uh, there are some people mm. who are asking us, can you always make profits? And what is the best money to start with to make profits, which are real? Okay, yeah, okay. One thing about financial markets, 
um, you can be profitable at the end of the day, at the end of the week, end of the month. You, you can be profitable. And it, but it doesn't mean that each and every trade is going to be a profitable trade. So you, you can have, say you can have five trades, and then you can have six trades or seven trades are profitable. Three, three or four trades um, are not that profitable, but still at the end of the day, uh, it's about making more money uh, than what you're losing. So it's about mm. a net gain. Not good to each and every game. I found team board, I said, and by the end of the season, Liverpool you know, is, is going to win the, the trophy, but they also lost, and it as you know, you go the whole season winning every game or not losing. Only one team is capable of that, and it's not Liverpool. <laughs> <laughs> well, right. then yes. um but in now I want to ask as well. Could the Canada got in now get a forex trading and you are yes. saying good it's about four weeks trading yeah. Tom but you know how we are good I double for that those four weeks. I'm to pay the to trade my live because now that she's gonna my live accounts, yeah see my live accounts. Yeah. So, so four weeks is really for our face-to-face -face lessons, and it. So, um, which is eight sessions, really. So, we'll be teaching you my basics and it, uh, how to use the software, um, the, how to use the trading platform software, and um, we also take you through my strategies and all of that. But as you pay at the end of those four weeks, I, I actually tell people at the end of those four weeks. That's when the real job starts. Because the book tanga we should apply those things practically. So guys, this is what I'm going to tap it for four weeks. For that, bye bye, bye bye. Uh, yeah, there you're out there on your own. There is a period of mentorship where you will be trading um, a, an account. But I always encourage people to start with a demo account. So probably I'm answering a question in Saturday afternoon. Uh, can I instang out trade? How much should I start off with? When you're starting to trade, start off with zero, nothing. So you're going to trade a demo account. So a demo account um, has got all the market conditions of a real live account. But the only difference is that you, you trade in using virtual money. But everything else is due, the exchange rates, everything is, is real. So you then get to practice. What's going on with zero? You know, you can simulate. So this, this is yeah. like the simulator. So you're going to make your mistakes, you're going to correct your mistakes, and you get to a stage where you feel good. No, I think uh, I'm now profitable, consistent, it's really a bit consistent. I'm not saying, to I got a marine house, over oh, there, no, let me go, I'm, I'm, I'm not a profitable trader. Uh, it needs to be over. My own recommendation is do demo trading for between one month and three months. Uh, I know a lot of people don't want to hear that. You know, I can tell you most of the people that come through the training uh, want to make money like yesterday. So, uh, uh, but, but, but you need to be patient. You, you need to be patient if you don't want to lose money. Because in our security, in Forex, uh, you always pay school fees. So you're going to pay directly or indirectly. So it's, it's just better to just go through the course uh, do your demo trade. When you are now profitable, uh, you don't even need anyone to tell you to trade. Not a zona. But I, I'm also still available. I can assess your your progress to see who now ready. If you are not ready, you know that uh, don't deposit any real money yet. Oh, right. Uh, I'm seeing Argo Punza team. Industry of Forex, especially Paku with Dromari, Panoda Visa card, Chitere, Utimariangu is secret. Oh, okay, yeah, that's, that's a very good question. You know, like, um, okay, maybe for you, for me to answer this question fully, you need to understand the funding side, not the withdrawal side, because how you fund will affect how you withdraw. So, say, for example, Munomu Zimbabwe. Um, we've got uh, we've got people on our Visa card, Visa Mastercard, and it. So what you can yeah. do, you and your account, you just deposit your US dollars onto your Mastercard. 
the or visa card then you can use that card to then fund your your trading account and it so let's let's say for example why is that two hundred dollars for example a trader, a trader, it a profit maybe one three hundred dollars, and you you want to over the annual need the man, I need to draw that three hundred dollars. So this is what happens: the two hundred dollars um, goes back to you uh, using the same method you used to fund. So so if you use your Mastercard, your Visa card, the, your initial deposit will go back to your to your card, and it you know you know and. and and it, then the extra hundred dollars profit now. Uh, that one you can put it per, per card. On your card, you can only put the uh, maximum of what you deposited. That one you, you then need to withdraw. There are so many other ways of withdrawing. You can use uh, wire transfer, which is like Swift. I, I wouldn't recommend it for a small amount like hundred dollars because no real were for fitting charges. In my bank, <laughs> or you can use going on Screw, Screw or Net Teller. Those are e wallets. Sikayango uh, fana na ne ne iko keshe pa internet sort of the uh, Screw kind of Net Teller. So you have your wallet, so you can withdraw your money onto that wallet, the Screw and Net Teller. And um, it's it's not very difficult to convert your Net Teller to add cash. Was most traders, if not more than ninety percent of traders, fund their accounts using Screw and NetTeller. So let's say only hundred dollars they are per NetTeller or, or, or per Screw. It is just a question of transferring to someone. They give you cash, but there's a bigger demand for Screw uh, than the supply. So you won't be stuck. Okay. But you also got other methods like. Um, like with the broker that I use, they can issue you a Mastercard that, that you can use. So you, you you can then put your profits onto that Mastercard. Um, All right. But when that's my crypto, you can even withdraw it, it Bitcoin, Ethereum, and so on, if, if, you, if you want. But the easiest way in the escrow, um, that, that's the way I'm doing it. So it's, it's, it's quite easy and convenient. Oh. Right. Pane uh, Ajans, can you repeat address? All right. Uh, what what they can do is they can contact you, and it? Oh yes, yes. Um, maybe yeah. I can give you WhatsApp WhatsApp number. Um, okay. Is that okay. Okay. It's zero seven seven two um one forty three two 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 six. Is it zero seven seven two? Zero seven seven two. Yeah. Um, one four three double two six. That's WhatsApp. Don't try and call that number. I I eat in my calls. You don't get a WhatsApp, but you can you can WhatsApp call. It's fine. But one four three four two six. One four three double two six. Or double two six. Two two six. Which means in a in a plus two six three. No, no, out of the country. Last yes, yes. Two, six, three. Right. So, phone number, yeah, Mr. Tawanda, for my comments. So, you can check out, there it is, my screen. You can check out the number. Yes, that's it. Then someone is asking, can you find, can you find your trade account with PayPal? Um, it, it depends with your broker, but uh, from my own experience, uh, very, very, very few brokers take PayPal. For some reason, I don't know why. But it should be a very convenient way of uh, depositing and and withdrawing. Um, but for some right. reason, the, the, the brokers don't don't really use PayPal. All right. Then someone is asking, "Could you one chance?" broker all right okay what i would do is um you can visit www.forex.co.zw that, that will take you to our broker all right www.forex.co.zw so, exactly. www.forex.co.w. 
you will be able to contact Dupanubawana broker Anu Shandisa. Yeah, that's right. So I'm seeing, I'm trying to see some of the comments. Anzi Kofi Yaka Fanana Eri. Anzi Yaka Fanana Eri ne Bitcoin. Uh, no, not really. Um, Bitcoin is 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 a digital currency. Oh, uh, what is Bitcoin trading? Oh, uh, okay. Bitcoin is a digital currency. It's, it's a, a cryptocurrency. Uh, then forex is a financial market. So um, you you can even trade Bitcoin actually uh, on these forex platforms. It's not only Forex that you trade. You, you can trade uh, Forex, uh, my shares, uh, my indices, whether on Apple, on Apple, Google, uh, Microsoft, Tesla, you know, all of those my shares, you, you can trade them. You can also trade other code indices. So those are stock market indices. Come to Monsana Dow Jones, I remember on news, on BBC, CNN, you can trade Dow Jones, um, NASDAQ, SP 500, and also. Uh, you can also trade my cryptocurrencies foot um, the same way you trade the other currency pairs. Go, go on a gold. Yes, gold, yeah, you will come this gold, crude oil, and a blue now, where we are going to have a new Marie Wicker at up for a blue now, greater crude oil. So, yeah, <laughs> so we, I always say, wherever there is an opportunity, there's a challenge, there's always an opportunity. That's the, it's, it's very sad what's happening now with the lockdown and so on. But you know, I'm not for money lockdown. Yeah, that of that are they open because you know, like are the financials in the lockdown are required? And also, is it safe to trade because you know, was I now when I said an article agents the trillions of dollars that we wiped out in the Nema lockdown? Mm. Yes, okay. Um, the financial markets are open. Um, okay, I'll, I'll give you, say, example, yeah, the, the financial center of the world, which is New York. Um, I think it is on the New York Stock Exchange, they've enforced a yeah, 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 lockdown. So people are actually not going physically there. But as you know, because most of the trades are not being done electronically. You, you actually don't need people there on the, on the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. Um, then the other question, um, sorry, I didn't get this, the second part. Well, and is it good to that this time, you need to look at exactly what you are trading. So if with some certain instruments uh, that are a bit more volatile than others, uh, then you've got some instruments, even though they are volatile, their movement is a bit more predictable than others. So easy, uh, you actually need to trade with caution because, okay, I'll give you an example. Um, I, I trade you know, NASDAQ quite a lot. Um, so normally, uh, I don't want to get too technical, but normally in a, when the markets are normal, in a daily movement, yeah, about $100, but price here, yeah, the index, yeah, when all things are normal. So it's up or down about $100. That's the range. But now ever since this COVID thing started, uh, it's, it's been going, instead of that $100 range, it, it can go up to even $1,000. So it makes it very risky. So so the, the markets have, have become, some of the markets, like stock markets, they, they've become five to 10 times more more volatile than, than they usually are. So Pakada right. Roma, you, you really need to be careful. You really need to be careful. Um, you, you can, it's very possible, you should know what you're doing. You, you can lose a lot of money. But um, the, the, opposite, the opposite is also true. But we also have got other, uh, other instruments that are not as volatile as Anana NASDAQ. Um, maybe you could, you could look into, the, in, into those. But now, it's, you know, where the world is experiencing something that she has never experienced before. So it's very difficult uh, for, for, for anyone to really predict which, uh, what's, uh, how, how the financial market is going to react 
to what, 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 what's happening because this is unprecedented. It has never happened in our lifetime. Even the experts, um, or whether the health experts, the, the, the economy, the economics experts, and so on, they, they don't really know what they. Usually, uh, between April, between May, things get very copy. Between June, where will we? So it's it's, yeah. a, it's a very difficult time. Yes. All right. Then uh, someone is asking, Guti, can I give you money so that you can trade on my behalf? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't know how many people. You, you know, as then they told me, I didn't know she joined. She got under dollar. Whenever I ask, when people actually request that that kind of thing for me, I I gyro over and ask Zara. I'm going to throw that the five majors. Well, okay. To, to answer your question, um. It's not something that I recommend. Um, and I'm not even sure whether it's really legal, actually, because that's taking deposits. Maybe they, they use some other jurisdiction, they use some other authority. Um, uh, but it's not something that I recommend. The best thing that you should do is to acquire the knowledge of how to trade and, and trade for yourself. So even for me, I'm, I'm, I don't trade for people. I, I would rather teach you how to trade. Then I, I can help you even uh, when you're trading, you still need help. I, I can help you with that. Because once you give someone money to trade, one thing you need to know is that person is either going to make money or is going, is, is going to lose money. So you need to be prepared for both outcomes. Uh, so you know, just being in control of your own money is best. Oh. Yeah, what's not that is we take out on our own bargains in a way? I miss him. I took it one hour when you go one hour two hundred dollars. You didn't, you didn't, twenty minutes. You know, you know, one of my children, not two parts are rumbles. Two things fear and greed. When you are greed, greed, Munano, I've seen those WhatsApp messages and so on. Munano puts out a um, and you pay the two million five hundred dollars by eco cash after an hour and doctor said, I did that grinding year one thousand. Honestly, honestly, <laughs> do you think that's possible? This is another one, Tango Taraj. There will be no poverty in this world if that's possible. anyway. If, if that guy can double the money in an hour, why does he need your five hundred? Just do a bit of me. I think, um, a dollar, if you double a dollar. Um, with a dollar over two dollars, or at four dollars, eight dollars, sixteen, and so on. Uh, I think by before you get to 20, 20 times, uh, you'd have reached, I think, a million dollars. So, so uh, you, you would ask yourself, you interrogate that, which is, is that possible? But people don't listen to reason because of greed, it's no car, and it's as is possible as but I know I can't remember. I WhatsApp and say Mary, and the message from my son Mary Murpa WhatsApp. Then after two hours, go and the administrator left the group. <laughs> we read about these things almost every every week. There's something, but one, uh, you just if something is too good to be true, and it it usually is. So you really need to be careful. So many so many fraudsters out there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. But it's it's great. It's just like um I'll give you an example. It's something that was this a few years ago. Change the triple A man. It was some um, sort of pyramid type of thing where you you would, uh, you, you would do you'd make money for, for really from really doing nothing. <laughs> um but it, it that that those things collapse. So but when Generally, anything is not get like a multi-level pyramid type of thing. In any for me, I, I just say stay away. I I I never involve myself in, in those those kind of things because uh, there's never a happy ending. Kuno or the rest. 
In fact, the majority they never get to get a single penny out of it. So yeah. um, you don't need to be careful, careful out there. You just use logic. It's really too good to be true. Um, right. So you someone to is asking, Anzi, thanks, man, for good work during the lockdown. I think the other person... All right, all right. After a woman, Anzi, Anzi, T-Mark, we need T-Mark. Uh, team and <laughs> random date for exchanging. <laughs> no, no, I, that that guy is actually good. You know, um, oh, I, I, I've never met him personally, but but um, oh. from 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 Zandaka owner, he, he, he trades the real markets. Um, I, I noted that the real markets. He, he has been um, practicing for for years, and he has now mastered this this trade. Uh, and fortunately for him, he is able to trade huge, huge amounts of money. So I need to have my profits I can achieve. If, if you look at that, that's genuine. That's real money. What he's doing? That do you go for it? Say I try, try. So I go to the forex. I mean, upon me, we are going to end up on me. We are going to go to on a change. We are website not available. I'm not sure why, but Anzi, the website not available. Oh, Forex or C or Eh. All right. Okay. No, not no, not a problem. Uh, I will check. And unfortunately, um, I, I I didn't I didn't check. Maybe there's a technical problem. But what what then, he can do, uh, he can just send me a message, mo, mo, mo WhatsApp. Uh, yeah, for WhatsApp then, number. Then, 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 then after this chat, I'll, I'll go and check. Put the put the what was the problem? There could be a technical problem with my. All right. Uh, with my. And how do you know? Post. And how do you know that this one is the right broker? Okay, f first of all, um, the thing I would say, look at. Okay, if, if the other people have used that broker, you, you can ask them what, what has been their experience with that broker and it. Then also look at the number of years that they've been operating. And it, uh, also look at uh, in other are they re regulated in um, in various jurisdictions and it. Uh, then the, the, the other thing also maybe what you can do is um um. Okay, I, I talked about number of years and it. So, a broker that has been there for the past ten years, and it uh, usually that's that's a very good broker. But there could be other newer brokers. I mean, I'm not saying they are bad, but you just need to do a little bit of homework. But for me, I'd rather go with the tried and tried tested brokers and uh, stay away from some of these other. Surely the ones that are coming out of South Africa, I have been hearing horror stories from there. Uh, I'd rather go for an international program. All right. Then uh, someone is asking as well, Hansi, um, let me see, Hansi, what is your advice for someone who wants to try digital market? What is your take between forex trading or virtual currency? Oh, I'm not sure if I understand the question. Um, Oh, yeah, it's, it's also a bit difficult for me to understand the question. But, but like what I said, uh, for, the Forex is a financial market. They don't want to Bitcoin, those, those um, cryptocurrencies. And it, so, but yeah. you can still trade them. Most brokers will still allow you to trade uh, the cryptocurrencies. Uh, but right. it's, it's like in saying, yeah, we are comparing an industry, ne a component of the industry. Don't, don't, I think those will be taken. Oh, yeah, yeah. Then someone is asking, which can I trade even if I'm out of Zimbabwe? You can trade anywhere with an internet connection. That's that's the good thing. Um, that's the beauty of your forex trading. As long as you need access to internet, uh, you can trade. It doesn't matter to report. All right. Then someone is saying, which strategy do you use, boss? And Anzi, can you recommend me a good mentor or can you be my mentor? Uh, sure. Um, my, my number, I'll just repeat it. Uh, plus 263-772-143-226. 
uh, okay, you can contact me on on WhatsApp after um, after this live session, and then I'll, I'll I'll definitely reply. Well, the only challenge we're supposed to have a class starting tomorrow, a April our April class class, but because of the lockdown, that's not going to be possible. So what we're now doing is we're now doing um, online lessons because we also want people to be safe. Because it and so on. But we can we can do it online. And it is the same way I do it uh, this video with uh, Mr. Punti is uh, I can also do my we can use Zoom, we can use Skype. It's 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 too possible with technology. It's too it's too possible for us to continue. Yeah, with yeah, yeah. I true. Technology is, is doing wonders, you know. Because so Mr. Jawanda is in Arare, Zimbabwe. In I mean Cape Town. And someone who is watching it is from Mark Australia, Mark UK, Mark UK, we are all watching like we are we are we are in the same room. So it's something that is interesting. So someone is asking, what's the difference between trading and gambling? All right, the gambling. How, how, how I would um, define gambling? Um, can I teach him? Okay, I think first of all, no, no, don't get me wrong. <laughs> don't get me wrong. First yeah. of all, almost everything in life is a bit of a gamble. You go, you go to invest. In, that's a gamble there because it's not guaranteed that you're going to get a job. Or once you even if you get the job, it's not guaranteed that you get the job that satisfies you. So that's a gamble. If, if I'm going to go and open a shop, that's a gamble. If if I train to plant maize, that's a gamble. You know, and all of those things. But couldn't outright gambling is a Munana soccer bet, Juga, and I think that's what he's referring to. Uh, if you do something without really a, a proper strategy, uh, no risk management, it becomes gambling. It doesn't matter what you need to Even um, anything becomes gambling. You don't do research on what course you are you want to do at tertiary level. You are taking a nenge a gambling. I'm not mending it. Mending it. Mending it. It then becomes a, a, a gamble. But with 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 the forex trading, it's not it's not a gamble because what you are doing is you are trading the financial markets, the the international financial markets. Um, there's there's really there's really no market player, one single market player that has got so much power to single-handedly um, influence the the prices. Or I would say um, the exchange rate. Say for example, even my prices, my stocks, my indices. Uh, this, this is a proper financial market, and not only that. Well, a lot of people, uh, one was the actual stock market. Well, but what people actually don't know is the stock market is, is small compared to, to the Forex market. But well, I'm talking of a global turnover. Yeah, the stock market, you're looking at a global turnover of, say, five, $500 billion. But Forex market is more than $5 trillion per day. It's, it's, a, it's the world's largest financial market. And it's a shame hey. that a lot of people don't know about it. Even on my bank, in a, I'm, I'm an ex-banker. Um, I will tell you, my, my treasury departments, oh, one was here, yeah, my treasury bills, they do check. Uh, I the, 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 the lack of knowledge in my international financial, my, my international financial uh, market is shocking. And those people, I don't know, 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 it's it's a, it's a shame. It's a shame. We we, we are educated, but we are, we are not knowledgeable. Uh, probably there is a big problem with our education system. We we are either being taught the wrong things, or our curriculum is just so out of uh, outdated. It's outdated. Yeah. Yes. Oh, sorry. I, I, I answered the question. <laughs> I didn't go and say other things. But anyway, yeah, yeah, I, I hope yeah. I've answered your question. Panyaya gambling. And then, okay, the, the other thing we say, and it, you are in Cape Town, and it, so what people yeah. need to realize is, is is that careers have changed. A lot of things have changed. The thing about Muna, I got there are my fax machines. 
and it that person is out of business because no one uses fax anymore. So careers yeah. have also changed. In in this new new world, that this internet age, um, you know, we have got YouTubers <laughs> who are making <laughs> millions. <laughs> and it's yeah, yeah. Mr. 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 Kunti, Mam, Mark Twitter, Mam, millions, and so on. And but that, yeah. that's a career man, my careers are changing. A, a, a kid, um, a teenager. And it I quit um live streaming on what's called Twitch as Tamba video game. And it that person makes thousands a month and it making more money than a professor. A writer, a writer 20 years around called Ziza shit. And it, so what people need to understand is you need to adapt. Uh, and things like on another forex trading is, is, is the other way of um, actually adapting to the new world order. That's how they so it's, it's, it's adapt or die for real. Oh, right. Someone is saying, I believe one Murugudzi Dharmana Bozi and Lugunye Bele Bartolos Masho Goma Kukuta Kuti Nika Eru Chinja. Someone was telling me now we start up an MA video negative. Danza Stray Masi was there at Anga Beja Mso Anga Pira in Uber. This is Uber, yeah, Uber, Uber. Meno Nika Zinai yes. Uber. Yes. Anzi, Anzi, I don't know the driver was in the Gati Risi Basakata Ham, Dara Paka Ipa Nika Eru Chinja. As the Gajinda, as in the twenty years, she drive our yellow key, as the stays go. But as my yellow key, but no number move there. As the nine twenty years, she drive. Then all of a sudden, Hong Kong went on the Uber. And as the Adam Mujanga Chitora, but she did that, this would take us another Uber so full race. This is the Katakatanga with the Arad Chitas. And then the demands that was not to marry out to Estopira, a Chatuani Macasto, Majada says, as the Scatters would if you can't beat them, let's join them. But that you know, Uber. But he and the idea is to answer my letter as a Murray writing as what ah, Baba, Zurpa Mawani is for Uber, Baba, as Gatinda, as the Vadi Kukuma, Mama Autonomous vehicles, mothers, no spaddles, no drivers. That's my mother said that Zurpa Mawani is usually even if you are here, if you are watching a Uber, you are in Uber drivers. You are in the next two, three years, or one and a tank, a panic person, and engaging with Saka takes drive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, that, that's that, 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 that's very true, Mr. Kundai. Uh, we need to continue update. The study is was the internet has just disrupted things. Uh, but it's also presenting my, my opportunities. How many millionaires have been created by the internet? I can't understand it. So in, instead of maybe being a victim of, of the internet, you, you should actually embrace it and actually use it to take you to the next next level. Yeah. So someone is asking, what is the difference between trading and investing? And is it right. possible to invest in Forex? All right. Um, trading, we could trade and we are to Nungo Rupanyang and Nungo Chita you decide what to buy, what to sell, and so on. And you do it, you execute the trades yourself. The then you invest in is, is uh, entrusting that to a third party. Oh, like I was saying, Munom, I'm still trying to get around the legal framework here, Munom. Um, if you're going to, to get into any products where you invest, make sure with the, whoever that you're dealing with um they, they, um they are regulated there, there's there's some oversight over what they are doing uh, that way you avoid one you know you know what's up where you know you know to me right 500 by cash after an hour you can get 1000 and things like that because those people will, will never be able to go through the the regulatory processes that require them for them to but in 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 other countries uh zimbabwe are lagging behind honestly I'll tell you a few years ago, there's this um, Securities and Exchange Commission of Zimbabwe. 2016, I went there. I wanted to, under, to, to, to hear their take on, on forex trading. But, you know, I got there, they didn't even know what it was. And these, these people are supposed to be our financial regulators. And they know nothing, zero charge. So hey. that's the that we are in. But as well, one thing that I know, so South Africa, they are very progressive. Um, my brokers, my team, my investment houses that are regulated. One thing that I'm very confident that 
probably say Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe to not go by check in South Africa will just go copy paste, copy paste. So probably watch a couple you know, what the South Africans have done when it comes to this these non-banking financial services. Then probably we could have an, an industry, a main investment. Because a lot of people want uh, there are a lot of people who want to, want to get involved in Forex, but um, they don't have the time, or maybe they, they think which maybe they, they won't be able to do it or whatnot. Uh, but with the current setup that we have in Zimbabwe, um, it's, it's too a bit difficult. But we, we try, we're trying to change it. We're actually uh, talking to some some people who my office, office, hopefully we'll, we'll make some headway. Right. Uh, hey, I'm gonna, I believe we are learning. Do we have people who have got other questions as well? Because before Koma Tawanda Mayenda was the ticket to the Nguyen is as a full one hour, so I tell us some one hour. So if there are people who have got questions, please feel free to ask. But uh, what, what do you say about the moon and what do you need to tell me? I'm so keen to go for What is your, your, your advice? Okay, first of all, it's, it's knowledge, first of all. Uh, what a lot of people don't tell you about Forex is, is, is actually a very big failure rate, Forex. In, in case, uh, but uh, when you look at study statistics and look at those people that lose money for Forex, you, you see which is, most of them are new. And it is someone who have been trading for less than six months. And and most of them don't even know children's risk. So so don't know even know anything children's risk management. So you have got people who are trading and it, but those those people are trading without knowledge and it, and they, they, they then um, um the industry then ends up with this very bad statistic or, or yeah, a high failure rate. But when you look at those are things that can be avoided. And it is. So, so I, I encourage people to teach it. Please, please acquire the knowledge first. Education. Most don't go on to, they, you always pay school fees directly or indirectly. The one that you pay directly, and again, I show you, it's much less than what you, than what you pay uh, indirectly. indirectly. Yes. <laughs> right. Someone is saying, uh, and the question I'm going to answer for being to us, no, it's a queen face that in forex. I'm not sure, I'm not sure if I'm understanding the question as well. As no, it's a queen face that in forex. A quick queen investor, that's what I was saying, which investing entails you giving uh, your money to a third party. And it is a Munom Zimbabwe with our current ceremony. I, I, I don't think there's that provision. If you, if you get into such arrangements, it's it's purely a, a, a private arrangement. And when something goes wrong, there, there's really no recourse. And it, but if it's a, a regulated uh, industry, I, I mean, the Panama chances of people cheating you. And it, uh, so, but, but instead of investing, why, why not? Because it, it could be years away from um, my proper uh, regulations that will allow that in Zimbabwe. But you you can trade you, you can acquire the knowledge uh, if, if you if you need help you can surround yourself with other traders which is very important um, and when I say surround even buying up by YouTube and it, instead of ngona uh, my video also uh, look at what other traders are doing or know what their methods um, but you know what there's a big shame when it comes to in, in social media. Go by Instagram. A lot of people or, uh, are busy showing off their Rolexes. But Munye Ambo Kudzi, any trading setup, you know, can you, or Ambo Etienne analysis, Anga Shimokuraki Zai, my Rolex, my Chichi, and so on. And people fall for that. And it's bait. You know, kind of bait, and people fall for that. So it's very, very important. Uh, when you are looking at the people to follow by social media, look, look for someone who actually shares uh, educational knowledge 
rather than someone who just shows you a picture here or like here. That was that's not going to help you with anything. Right. Don't go on Muriat on the Nyerja or Pana. Paragons is in I always see those people coming to my inbox, Pamu Pan Instagram, uh Banas Baji, Pa Facebook, one we are. Vanos <laughs> ndiketa <laughs> It's fake money. Could you know the prop money? Have I heard of prop money? We just want more movies. Yeah. Do I get it? Because someone can notice. But no, this is this is not real money. It's fake. And we that champagne. You know, we can try apple apple juice. Okay, some glass of champagne. It still looks like champagne. So, so um, there's a lot of fakeness out there, especially in this industry. There's a lot of pretending, there's a lot of fakeness. So you really, really, really need to be careful. Was Makawa, Kawa, Makawa. Right. So guys, <laughs> do you know something? The reason why I had to deal with Chawanda is because I have met him on the internet. I have met him physically and I have had, I have I have attended his uh ma 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 ma, ma teachings and his school. I have attended it. So Oh <laughs> 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 There's no way for me to close it. And someone is trying to call me. Please, ngambo mira kana miyaru kundu na pana. Right, so okay. Do pana niya guys, just be careful. What is it? Just be very careful. Msa msa niya isa kuti ba ti ba wanda nechi nechi. Chingotra ya kuwa na muna no kwanza kuti tisa. I believe uti kana ngo ri pana ba ngo istira zaster na na chawanda. You can see the way he's explaining. Apana pana buguri taka na zis basko rakiri mire ma vire arima sportsi go karachi arumi ya songo tana ngula things as they are andi zika so just be careful indro dona ngwa no tuya ai ni gana account ya kanzi gana wati ampo roland ana dano ngwa no tuya ai tuya tuya jinimbi andi zika ukwa tata jinimbi pa account pa kaka tonyo rato wa wane forex trading mbomina ya kundi neta andi zika wazi kuna na no tuya ma pictures ana jinimbi ni ma chichi over ya <laughs> All right, uh, one hour mm. So thank you so much, Mukoma Chawanda, for your time. If there are people who want to connect with you, phone number Zawota Zawora. You can just check the video. You know, but if even my comments, you will also see phone number Zawota is. So you can also check out his website www.forex.co.zw. So that's it. 
forex.com. What forex.com are you on? I see you. It's forex.co.zw. Yeah. Hey, Aman, come on, guys. <laughs> so, guys, thank you so much for joining me. <laughs> All right, thank you, thank you very much. Uh, in the next video, come on, Aman, thank you so much for your time. Both one, I have to find so I will have to see you in the next video. All right, so thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you very much. All right. All right.